T-Systems is the business-to-business -business arm of Deutsche Telekom. So we provide IT and telecom services to businesses in the UK, across Europe and throughout the world. So my role is I'm the Vice President of IT Delivery here. I'm a member of the Board of Directors. I'm responsible for delivery to all of our UK customers, be that customers who contract here directly in the UK or global customers where they have an operation in the UK. Mm -hmm. So in terms of my role and my team and the work we do here in the UK, from the data centre all the way up to the applications and the consultants who run those IT services with the customer within my remit, from the point of the customer being sold for the whole life cycle of a contract, my team deliver those services to the customers. So as I said, our, our business splits primarily into two, IT and TC. And uh, you know, as a traditional outsourcer, starting in the late 90s, we've moved and evolved pretty much to an exclusive cloud services provider, just the way IT has gone. And we are about business, so we're not you know, providing retail cloud services, we're not providing cloud services to individual end users. What we provide primarily is what we call VPC, virtual private cloud. So it's cloud that is hosting enterprise applications like SAP, large retail web installations, things that businesses use uh, that are secure, safe, private, sometimes multi-tenanted still, you know, adapting, using technology, getting the benefits of leverage shared infrastructure, but in a private way that's totally secure on a private network with the data protected in a secure data center on a secure platform. Some of the biggest retail telecommunication web services are hosted within our data center. So traditionally we've always owned our own facilities, both here in the UK um, and in other parts of the world. But as the years have moved on, a number of things continue to change. Technology gets denser, power consumption goes up, and in like, like many things, it's all about scale. So we traditionally would own 2,000, 3,000 square meter facilities um, and manage those from mechanical and electrical upwards. But just like we say to our customers, you focus on what you do best and uh, we'll focus on what we do best. We'll run your IT services, we'll design your IT services to underpin your business. We now look to partners who specialise in designing and implementing those data centres of scale and quality so we can leverage off their expertise and their scale. Um, and it's a much more um, comfortable model for us. It brings contract flexibility, it enables us to grow, it enables us to shrink. Um, and it enables us to plan better than having to continually invest and manage our own facility. Firstly, that contract flexibility. So look, looking for someone who's looking for a long-term relationship, who wants to work with us, and who can help us put together some kind of relationship that enables us to cope with a business that goes through peaks and troughs. Um, again, we can replace an old platform with a new platform and suddenly have 50% of our space free again and start trying to manage some of those challenges, plus growth that can come um, very fast and very quick. Um, one large deal can double your footprint in any given data center at any time. So something that gives us contract flexibility to be able to cope with some of those demands was important. Not in the very short term, but at least in the midterm. So someone who could contractually work with us to come up with the right relationship. Because as an outsourcer, our business does tend to grow and shrink. Also our employees, um, you know, that we take uh, take the responsibility of a significant power consumer seriously and what we're doing to kind of minimise the impact that has on the environment. Um, from Deutsche Telekom down that's taken a huge amount of focus because obviously globally we are a massive data centre user and that is having an environment, in, uh, environmental impact. A strong approach and a good story in terms of green around that data centre was another really uh, significant um, aspect. Finally, I think about quality. Um, again, we are a business-to-business -business premium tier um, outsourcer. We're not the cheapest, and that's deliberately not, not our strategy. We're here to deliver real quality services to our clients. Um, certainly, they want to benefit from buying IT services off a, um, an outsourcer or a service provider rather than doing it internally. I think the facility is very impressive you know, as a physical facility to, um, to visit and look around. And that's certainly a benefit in terms of us bringing some of our cus potential customers of the future, you know, and showing them where we would house their facilities if they, if, they, if they went down that way. So that's a real benefit. The mid and the long term that we've agreed in terms of how we can scale up, how we might be able to scale down, how we'll be able to manage um, the demand that we might encounter in the future. So that has certainly been very satisfying and, 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 and pleasing.